Hello my dear friends, in this video we will going to discuss another example that is numerical number 11. What is that a piston cylinder arrangement at shown in figure, this is a piston cylinder arrangement, contains air, that means the air, contains air 250 kilopascal and 300 degree centigrade, right? So the state 1, so the state 1 is given, what is that? State 1 is that P1 250 kilopascal and T1 300 degree centigrade right and mind it air system what is the system system is air right and this is a closed system closed system right so this is your situation now the 50 kg piston that means the piston piston is mass of the piston 50 kg right this is the piston mass and the cross section area is also given it is diameter i think not area it is in the form of diameter so what is the diameter 0.1 meter this is your diameter right okay initially push against the stop so initially there is a tight high pressure that means the piston will push against the stop that means piston will exert a force on the stop this is the high pressure right the atmospheric condition so this is the atmospheric condition what is that the atmospheric pressure is this much and this is your temperature right cylinder cools as heat transfer to the ambient so the finally from the cylinder heat will transfer right so at what temperature does the piston being to move down so at what pressure so at what temperature say you can say that at what temperature so when the piston will move down when the piston will move down that means just lose its contact so at that condition at that condition if this is your free body diagram if this is a free body diagram so this is the pressure against atmospheric pressure force what is that p naught and there is a weight of the piston mg into p and there is a pressure and this pressure is the exerted by the air exerted by the air so what is the downward pressure force so p naught plus pressure due to piston so what is the this is your downward pressure this is in downward direction so what is the pressure 100 plus mg by a into 10 to the power minus 3 this is a kilo pascal right so what is that 100 plus what is m 50 what is g 9.81 what is area pi by 4 d square what is d 0.1 k square into 10 to the power minus 3 so what is this value this is your 1 
62.45 kilo pass so this pressure will exerted by the this is the pressure exerted contributed by the piston weight of the piston and the atmospheric pressure right so but what is the initial pressure of the system initial pressure of the system p1 is what it is your 250 250 kilopascal and when it is reaches to p2 is equal to 162.45 kilopascal so at this condition piston will just move down so this is the pressure p1 and p2 and what is the initial temperature what is the initial temperature t1 initial temperature of the system is what 300 degree centigrade so what is the temperature at which the piston will move down this is the question mark so when it move just move down when it start to move at that condition volume of the system is fixed there is no change in volume approximately so if you apply ideal gas equation so the piston will just start to move down so since volume of the cylinder remains constant during this process of heat rejection by the cylinder why because just move down so this is your p v is equal to m r t m is the mass of the system mass of the system which is fixed why because this is a closed system so p1 v1 by r t1 is equal to p2 v2 by r t2 so when it just moved down so volume is fixed same gas so what is the pressure p1 250 what is the temperature t1 300 plus 273 what is the pressure p2 62.45 what is the temperature t2 we have to find it so the t2 temperature is 372.33 kelvin which is 99.33 degree centigrade so if the temperature drop to 99.33 degree centigrade then it start to move down right okay now the second question is that the second question is that how far has the piston drop when the temperature reaches to ambient temperature so if this is our initial system if this is our initial system let's suppose this is our initial system let's suppose this is our initial system right and at that situation what is given the initial system this is your length is given let's suppose l1 l1 is given right so let's suppose this is our system so in the question says that 
how far has the piston drop so let's suppose the piston will drop this is your stop so let's suppose piston will drop to here let's suppose this is your let's suppose l2 l2 will drop right and this is our system so finally this is our system let's suppose this is our system so how far how far the piston drop when the temperature reaches so when this is at this point when the temperature is thrown so when it start to move down when it start to move down at this point the temperature is how much the temperature is 99.3 degree centigrade right so this is what this is your drop in height what is that drop in height this will drop in height right so this is your initial volume v1 and this is your final volume v2 right so when the piston start to move down it's a very slow process so in a quasi static equilibrium manner so the so the outside pressure that means the pressure due to atmospheric and pressure due to piston this is fixed value this is fixed value so inside pressure also fixed so this will move down at a constant pressure why because piston will move down in an equilibrium manner equilibrium manner so since outside pressure will same throughout so inside pressure will also say so this move so due to this so the movement movement of the piston at constant pressure so when it is constant pressure so we know that pv is equal to mrt so p1 v1 by rt1 equal to p2 v2 by rt2 since the pressure is constant so this will equal now what is the initial volume what is the initial volume what is the initial volume so if you convert it and this will also same so we can write like that v2 by v1 is equal to t2 by t1 so see so what is your v2 v2 is we don't know what is v2 but what is v1 pi by 4 into 0.1 this is the area of cross section the square into l1 so what is l1 250 mm cross 10 to the power of minus 3 meter 
right what is t2 final temperature it must to be surrounding temperature 273 what is initial temperature what is initial temperature so it just start to move down so this is initial temperature 72.33 here you note point there is two temperature there are two temperature t1 is 300 plus 273 kelvin one t1 is 372.33 kelvin so which temperature you put this is the temperature at which this is the temperature at which piston will move down just move down so this is your temperature not this right so from here what is your v2 so v2 is what v2 is if you solve 1.54 meter cube so this is your v2 right see see this is your v1 this is your v1 and this is your v2 right so if you calculate v2 put this height put this height so let this height is to be l small l so what is v2 here v2 is nothing v2 is pi by 4 d square into l so you have v2 you have d so this l has to be calculated so this is your pi by 4 d square into a small l so what is a small l small l is point zero one nine six six meter so this is your l from the base so what is the drop drop in height is what is what l1 this is your l1 minus a small l so what is l1 point two five what is a small l point zero one nine six six so if you have to calculate the five point three four centimeter this is your drop in height this is your drop in height all right thank you